He's an Albuquerque police officer and was part of Mayor Keller's security detail. That was until he got into an altercation with his wife and was arrested on domestic violence charges. News 13's Rebecca Atkins is live at APD with more. Rebecca. Well, Dean, police say the officer has been with APD since 2004. Officers say his wife flagged them down for help because he had been holding her against her will. The same day he was arrested, the case was dropped. He's always by the mayor's side, an Albuquerque police officer assigned to the security detail of the leader of the Duke City. But on Monday night, Christopher Romero found himself on the other side of the law. Albuquerque police say that night, while at the Cottonwood Ranch apartments along Coors, Romero's wife, Barefoot, flagged them down. She said at their home, just minutes from those apartments, they got into an argument and she was in fear of his anger. She got in her car. That's when she says Romero forced himself between her and the car door, then shoved her and pulled the keys out of the ignition. She told officers he didn't hit her, but the director for the Domestic Violence Resource Center says abuse comes in all forms. Sometimes it's really shocking to us when we think about people who um, are known to be protective of our community. Amy Whitfield also says abusers come in many forms, even members of law enforcement. People in general that we think, man, that's such a great person, um, that sometimes we just cannot think about them as a domestic violence offender. But after officers met with Christopher Romero, they found enough reason to put him in cuffs. They say he admitted to taking her keys and not wanting her to leave, and say he smelled of alcohol and admitted to driving around looking for his wife. But the DA's office dropped the charge of false imprisonment. A spokesperson says since Romero's wife was able to get out of her car and walk away, it doesn't fit the charge. Now, in that criminal complaint, officers say during a follow-up interview with Romero's wife, she said she didn't want him to get in trouble. The DA's office says if she wants to proceed with charges, they can refile under a different statute. Dean and Jess, back to you. All right, Rebecca, thank you. Both APD and the mayor's office declined an interview. APD says even though the DA's office dismissed the charges, Romero has been reassigned pending an internal investigation.